Hey there, Sue Moore here on day one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of the uh, 14 day challenge. And today I am bringing you a PSA, Sue's timely public service announcement. Um, with all the coronavirus stuff that's going on and um, Dallas uh, yesterday shut down all of the um, bars and restaurants and all of those things, you just can't help but think what the fallout of all that is. And that's really what I wanted to talk uh, to share with you today. So when you think of it, just restaurants alone, um, tens of thousands of people, tens of thousands of people woke up this morning in Dallas and they're no longer employed. I mean, what do you do? Okay, let's say, hey Carol, how are you? Uh, look at all the people that work in sporting, good event, uh, sporting goods or sporting events, I should say. Uh, like, um, hey, Barbara, how are you? People like Mark, uh, yeah, God bless people like Mark Human, who are still paying all of the staff for the Mavs during this, you know, blackout or whatever that they're doing with the sporting, uh, sporting uh, uh, games and so forth. How about all the people in travel? Do you think they're going like this? They sure are. And if you've been affected at all by this, or you know someone now that's affected by it, now is the time to look at a home-based business. Now, upfront and full disclosure, I'm in a home-based business, but that's not what this PSA is all about. I'm not here to recruit anybody. I'm just trying to say that if, if, the, if that had happened to me, and I was wondering how I was going to make the mortgage, or pay the utility bill, or put food on the table for my kids, I would at least investigate a home-based business whose products or services are something that are that is of interest to me. And because you gotta realize that the best place to make money these days in a side hustle or in something on the side is online. I mean, hello Amazon, you know, you can't go wrong. So, uh, and while hopefully this virus will, um, you know, start to begin to flatten out in the next maybe week, 10 days, hopefully, something else will be coming down the road. There'll be another something, hopefully not a virus like this, but something will come down the road. It's going to throw you for a loop, knock you off your pins. What are you gonna do? So what's your plan B? For that matter, what's your plan A? A lot of people don't even have that. So, now I know that not everybody is open or wanting to do a home-based business. Um, I happen to believe that just the tax benefits alone are worth it, but that's just me. So, um, and I also know that not everybody wants to be an entrepreneur, but everybody wants to make money. So let me end this little PSA with um, a question, and that is, if you don't at least investigate a, side, a, a home-based business, what else are you gonna do? Wouldn't you wanna save money, like I said, on taxes or make money from home um, where you didn't have to uh, go someplace? Just a couple hours a night, whatever it is. What else would you do to protect yourself from being susceptible to another virus or another da-da-da-da that's going to you know, alter the way we live for hopefully just a very short period of time. Hope that it doesn't happen again. I hate to tell you, my friends, but hope is not a strategy. It just doesn't work. So just from my heart to yours, please check out home-based businesses. If you don't like them, fine. But give yourself the opportunity to at least say, I checked it out and I didn't want it, okay? So... And the other thing I would offer you is, is um, if you'd like to have a conversation about what this is all about, again, I'm not recruiting anybody, but I have been in the business for six and a half years. I have learned a thing or five, and I have got great resources I could point, some, point you to. So that is the message for today. I hope you did get some value, and I wish you all the very best. Your call to action is I want you to marinate on what I just said. I want you to rewind re, uh, this video, listen to it again, and take action if you'd like. So that's it. Thanks, Carol. Thanks, Barbara, for jumping on. We will see you hopefully soon, and uh, talk to you. Bye.